YouTube. So, um, I'm kind of pissed off right now. As most of the people who own the Switch may already know, Octopath Traveler came out. What was it? A few days ago? A week ago? And, um, I was gonna get the Japanese copy since I'm getting a Switch, like, in two weeks. I was gonna import the Japanese copy because I wanted to play it in Japanese, you know. I like playing my, all my games in Japanese if it's from Japan. I'd better play the original version instead of the translated version because usually there are more errors when they're translated. So, I was looking around and I'm like, hmm, where should I get it from? Yeah, Amazon. Sold out. They'll be back in stock in two weeks, so I'm not gonna make it. Okay, um, uh, other sites, you know. It'll be in stock in two weeks. Okay, I'm like, well, I'm not, I'm not gonna get it anymore. And then someone told me, like, why don't I just get the American copy and change it to Japanese? And, um, I did think of that, but... So what I ended up doing was asking a few people I have on Instagram who uploaded pictures of the game. And I asked them if they had Japanese subtitles. And one of them was uh, from Europe, so they had the, he had the PAL copy. And he said, no, it only has English. And then another person said, it only has Japanese voice. And I'm like, okay, oh well. And I did look online too, I googled Japanese text for Octopath Traveler American copy, who knows what. And someone asked the same question and they were like, it only has Japanese voice, English text, uh, Spanish, French text, as I expected. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna give up. I guess I'll wait for the next time I import stuff from Japan. Then, so I was like, oh, I'm gonna post it on Twitter. And then someone told me that his uh, pal copy had Japanese text if he put the system in Japanese. Because I had read that the, what was it, the Chinese or Asian copy did the same. If you put the system in a certain language, the game will set to that language. And it got me thinking, like, maybe it does have Japanese. So I asked around again. And a very kind user on Instagram uh, tested it out for me and he ended up sending me screenshots of the game where it's in Japanese. He changed the system in Japanese and now the game's in Japanese. And another user on Twitter also sent me a screenshot or a picture. So I'm like, okay, it does run in Japanese. But the interesting thing is that, okay, so they don't really tell you that it does run in other languages. But I asked them, I asked Square Enix through email. I sent them a message saying, hey, uh, the local fast traveler have options for uh, playing it in Japanese text. And they responded a few days later, and this is what I got for the response. So they responded, thank you for contacting Square Enix support. We apologize for the delay in our response. Please note Japanese text is not available in the North American version of Octopath Traveler. We hope this information is helpful and thank you for contacting the Square Enix customer support. Yeah. What the hell? By that time I already knew the answer. So I was like, why do they hide it? Why do they keep this a secret? Why can't they just come out and say, hey, you can play it in Japanese or Spanish or French or whatever language you want if you change your system to another language? Is there a, some kind of a regulation that prevents them from doing this? Because I had this problem before where I think it was Demon Gaze. Um, I saw the game and I thought, this looks interesting, but I don't want to import it because it's kind of expensive uh, and I'm not sure if it'll be good. And then I read a review on some site website and that person mentioned that you can play it in Japanese too. So I'm like, oh, then I'll get it from GameStop. And then I picked it up. And I really liked it, so I got the limited edition and sold the regular copy. And then, a, few, a year ago I think, or who knows how long ago, they opened up pre-orders for the Demon Gates 2. And then I was wondering, I wonder if it'll have Japanese too, because uh, the original game was already out in Japan. Maybe they included that in the American edition. And I also asked NIS, America, and they said, sorry but the game will only be in English. I'm like, Okay, I'm not gonna pre-order it then. And I did look around and nobody had the answer because the game wasn't out yet. Then, a few months later, 
I was reading other reviews and stuff because I still wasn't sure. And they were like, oh yeah, you can play it in Japanese too. And I'm like, I could have gotten the limited edition and now they're selling it on eBay like for more than $100. So yeah, it bothers me a lot that they don't specify whether you can play it in certain language or not. Because before, I didn't even look for that option since most games weren't multi-language except for maybe Pokemon. And so, like, why do they hide it? Why? Especially if the game came out, Octopath Traveler, they came out almost at the same time everywhere. Why do they need to, like, not tell you that it's in other languages? It's not like if I was living in Japan, I was gonna get the American version just because, I don't know, unless I just wanted the limited edition. But if I'm living in Japan, I would get the Japanese edition because it'll have Japanese. If I'm living in the United States, I'd rather get the one from the United States if I can and if I can play it in Japanese. Um, I don't want to import every copy if I don't have to and I don't think that the companies want you to import or export copies. So why don't they tell you that the option is there? It kind of... Uh... So yeah, I'm pissed off. Yeah, yeah. Especially because they even responded to me and said that no, you can't play it in Japanese. So like, okay, why are you lying to me? Or they don't know? Or what? Anyways, uh, so yeah, this was just a short rant video. And also to let you guys know that you can play it in other language. And thanks to all the people who sent me information about this. Hopefully the next video I won't be complaining too much. <laughs> so yeah, thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And have a great day. Bye-bye.